What's good, guys? If you want cheap, fast, reliable MT, make sure to hit up my sponsor, SafeNBAMT.com. Use code BUGS for 5% off at checkout and stop getting scammed by NBA 2K's pack odds. Hit them up right now. What's good, YouTube? It is your boy, Bugs, back. And guys, today we're going over the top style filters in NBA 2K21, my team. And guys, today, um, we're just going to go over, our, I think, the best snipe filters in this game, guys. As you know, there is not a lot of snipe filters. So I'm going to try to break, break down some cheap ones, some good ones, all around, pretty much the best I could do. And if you guys are new to the channel, make sure to sub it up, comment down below. It would be greatly appreciated, man. We are on the road to 14,000 subs. It's been slow, I'm not going to lie. I've been trying to post videos, but you guys have not been giving me enough support. I need more support. Like up the video. Um, if you guys need MT, hit me up. I'm buying and selling MT. And uh, yeah, we are pretty much just going to go over the market best we can. And honestly, uh, before we do get into the market, let's show you guys some locker codes. Um, let's go over here. Uh, NBA 2K21 locker codes. Let's go real quick. Active locker codes. You can pause the screen. We just got this new one for an Isles 2 uh, Idol Series 2 pack. Pretty solid, man. We're just going to show you all the locker codes. And then we're pretty much just going to get into these snipe filters. So uh, those are the codes. You can pause the screen and whatnot. Um, you go on the website, whatever. Anyways, let's get into the top snipe filters. So I'm going to start off with the low end snipe filters. All right, boys. Um, so we just got this free throwback pack. Let's see if we can get anything. Um, lately, man, the pack odds have been crazy because as you guys know, I pulled the world's first Westbrook, which was absolutely insane. That was crazy. I was so excited I pulled that. But yo, let's get into it. So dark matter, right? We got Dark Matter. All right, let's talk about the market a little bit. Let's talk about the sniping. So right now, guys, Dark Matter is pretty down bad. And why is that? Because look at this triple threat online board. If you get 99 MJ, that's insane. You're going to get Michael Jordan for free. Chances are probably low. Ron Harper's eh. It's all right. But yo, you even get a chance at a 95 MJ at prize too. So that's pretty cool. I'm about to play PTTO a lot more. A lot of, there's a lot of ways to make MT. Honestly, guys, forget the sniping. If, this, if you want to snipe big money... I rather just play TTO. TTO, in my opinion, yeah, it's sweaty and whatnot, but like if you're good at the game, you should be able to win most games. Anyways, um, let's get into it, man. So let's talk about a little bit Galaxy Opal. You know what? No, let's start off cheap. We're gonna go over my favorite snipe filter still to this day. <sighs> it's gotta be this one right here. It's still the Amethyst one. It's still the Amethyst one. It's still the Amethyst one. It is the only consistent snipe filter that I love, okay? That's it. It's just the best night filter, period. Um, this is just literally the best night filter. I think if you want to make profit quickly, if you don't want to wait, if you don't want to deal with some BS, this is going to be your best night filter no matter what. So Amethyst, that's got to be money. Now, you don't want to obviously buy NBA 20 or NBA 21 players. You want to stay away from that. You want to try to snipe on this filter. So now, I've noticed that Amethyst filters dry. So what I've realized is that Amethyst Warp Reality is probably your second best bet. Not going to lie. It's pretty interesting. Um, so as you guys know, I did tell you to invest in as many warp reality players as possible. And look at this. Amethyst warp realities are over 2,500. They are over 2,800. So if you guys did invest, you made a lot of MT. It's simple. The cheapest one up there is 3,200 for precious Archiwa. That's not counting Matt Bonner and all the other players. So these cards were around 1,500. They're now 3,200. That is doubling your MT. That is absolutely insane. If you invested 100, you made 150K. So if you invested 150K, you now have 300K. It's that simple. You just have to listen to what I say. So right now, are the investments good? Right now, the investments aren't good. They released idols packs. So it's going to be hard to invest. It's going to be harder to snipe. Idols packs aren't guaranteed. And not only that, a lot of people don't like idols packs. And not only that, I don't think the content drop was that good enough to make the market crash happen in where you could invest. So right now, market's not really crashed. You could go ahead and sell your cards today if you really want to. It's just not a bad time to do so. Um, but like I said, put your filter to 11.50 here. We're going to go into the next one. We're going to go to Diamond Chibis. As you guys know, Simbular was very cheap. And you know what? NBA 21 players ruined this filter again. John Stockton ruins this filter again. So this filter is kind of ruined. There's really not that much you could do. So honestly, I'm going to stay away from the Diamond filter. It's kind of destroyed. You could try to snipe on it, but I feel like the profit margin on here is harder. It's a lot harder, especially with John Stockton right here at 2,000, 1,900. It's really going to ruin the filter. I would stay away from diamonds, man. Maybe put your filter to 19 or 1950. Um, that's probably the best way I can put it, man. It's going to be a hard snipe filter to run. Very hard. Next up, we got pink diamond. Pink diamond's okay. 
Um, it might be flooded with MJ's very soon. Even though MJ is MJ, it's literally Michael Jordan. But yo, yeah, you're gonna see a lot of his pink diamonds because it seems like he's gonna be common. Um, you pretty much want to snipe anything other than this MJ and Manu Ginobili. But then again, Michael Jordan's price might go up. So if you want to invest in this pink diamond MJ, he's actually pretty good. He's really not bad at all. This card is very good. He definitely does lack some badges. But you could always add the two. For 4K, you could definitely get this MJ. He could definitely ball out. He has amazing defense. He could shoot. And honestly, this MJ is pretty good. So I'm going to see. I'm going to buy that card. I'm going to attempt to sell for 4600 Not going to make that much MT, guys. I'm really just not going to make that much MT. But you know what? It's worth a try. Might as well. Um, so made a little snipe there. The snipes are pretty dry on Sundays. Not going to lie. It's better on content days. But let's keep it going, man. Um, let's talk about Dark Matter, Galaxy Opal. Dark Matter, man, it's super, super lucky. You have to be super quick. You have to have the perfect internet connection. You got to get super lucky when you snipe a Dark Matter. You also have to really, 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 like, just sit on it. But then again, since MJ, yeah, Dark Matter, is on TTL boards, you could potentially get this Dark Matter card. Like, you could have a probably, there's going to probably be a lot of more snipes on Dark Matters coming this week. Now, the only problem is, will they release a Dark Matter that, that isn't that good? So, which would actually make the Dark Matter filter crash, which means there will be no technical snipe filters left. That would suck. Obviously, Galaxy Opal is Galaxy Opal cheapest. And then I'm going to show you these filters that are low-key as hell. And here we go. So, we're going to start off with Small Forward Galaxy Opal. Actually, not Small Forward. Just Kevin Durant Galaxy Opal. Um, this filter is kind of hidden. No one really talks about it. You want to put your minimum buy to 100. See what happens. It's a pretty good filter. Someone I've been eyeing down a lot. Giannis, the pink diamonds, you can flip all day. When the market crashes, you can flip Giannis diamonds all day. Another one, obviously, is Giannis Opal, man. Giannis Opal is always going to be one of the best players in the game. And then another filter. This isn't really a filter. This is more of a scroll through and tr try to see what's going on. So, me, in my opinion, I think these Giannis's are still super usable. They're still so OP, guys. So, the Opal is obviously insane. But, yo, you want to pay attention to these Giannis's. They go up and down consistently. It's definitely very interesting. Another card is Ben Simmons. I, honestly, guys, since there's not a lot of snipe filters left, you kind of got to go by player. So Ben Simmons, Pink Diamond, another card that is very interesting. A point guard that is quick and has insane defense. Very tall, obviously, a point guard. Definitely something you want to pay attention to. And this Ben Simmons, man, very good card. He goes up, he goes down. It's just another player that I believe that could go up and down. But yo, that's all we got for the vid. We're going to end it off in an idols pack. Um, let's see if we can pull a Dark Matter quick. And we get in that roll. But yo, that is all we got for the video, man. Hope you guys enjoy. Stay tuned for more content. Have a good one. Peace.